So let's identify some um, blue grama grass. So blue grama um, is this short growing grass. It's short right now because it's about May and it's a warm season grass. So it won't really start to put on growth until probably July, but it won't still, depending on moisture, get much taller than about, about this high. You can tell it forms a mat. It spreads underground by roots. Um, it's a rhizominous grass. Um, the little um, leaves make kind of curly cues, the last year's leaves. And so that's one way you can tell it, tell, the, um, tell it apart from other grasses. It makes a um, seed head that looks like a, an eyelash. Seeds are only on one side of the, the stem and it looks like an eyelash. Blue grama grass holds its nutrition very well throughout the growing season, but it does not produce a lot of forage when compared to bigger grasses such as western wheat, prairie sand reed, and needle and thread. It provides good summer feed for grazing livestock if there is enough moisture available for growth. Just as a recap, for blue grama, it is a warm season grass. It has a seed head that looks like an eyelash. It spreads by an underground root system. It is short, no higher than three to five inches. It has curly Q leaves, and it provides good summer forage for grazing animals, but is less productive than other grasses.